The way high school athletes play sports could be changing. There's a new statewide plan aimed at making the playing field more even, and it may surprise you what it's based on. The Washington Interscholastic Association oversees high school sports in our state. They say some schools just don't have a fair chance when it comes to competing because so many of their students are low income. Now, right now, schools are ranked just based on how many students they have, but that well, that could change. Our Hawk Hammer working for you to explain. Hawk? There are two rule changes being voted on next Monday. The first, resetting how many students at each school align with each classification, 4A, 3A, 2A, and so on. The second, allowing the population of each school to be adjusted downward if the school has a large number of students who qualify for free and reduced lunches. North Central High School, the football team doesn't have the best of records. Last year, they won one out of ten games. We are currently right now at the bottom of the 3A um, pool in terms of the allocations for numbers at schools. We're at the bottom, and uh, it's, it's tough to compete. David Hall, the athletic director there, says when it comes to football, not necessarily their other sports, they're up against something that has nothing to do with practice time. Football is a numbers game. Unfortunately, we're not getting the numbers we need to get out to sustain uh, three quality programs at North Central High School. That bottom line, poverty. Maybe they didn't get enough experience ahead of time before they got to high school, and that's an e economic burden. Maybe they don't have the funds to do that. As a whole, North Central is up against more affluent schools in their classification, schools that have no trouble getting students to turn out for their teams. The divide is becoming a problem. Students at more affluent high schools have more opportunities in terms of club sports and those kinds of things, where students in schools of high poverty uh, typically don't. Prompting a relook at which schools play which schools, which is currently based on population alone. The disparity between the haves and have-nots has continued to grow. And so it's time for us uh, to take a look at the process of classifying schools. If the new amendments are passed, accounting for free and reduced lunch rates, a measure of poverty, here's what the Greater Spokane League would look like. North Central and Rogers would likely be bumped down to 2A. I don't think it's going to hurt anything. It just gives our kids an equal opportunity. And that vote would be on Monday the 28th. The district director of the WIAA uh, District 8 says other sports beyond football that the measure of inequality has been seen in beyond uh, football again girls basketball, volleyball, and both boys and girls soccer, all club sports, he says, uh, which emphasizes the point. I'm Hawk Hammer, KSLY 4 News.